Hello world, this is what a sweet potato farm is like. And where is this farm located? In Ibaraki. And the sweet potato museum and factory is actually inside an old converted school. Michael, where are we right now? We're at the tent right now. Uh, we slept in these beds. So was it cold inside? Inside here? Yeah. Uh, it wasn't that cold because um, we had the heater. What's the temperature outside right now? Um, it's like zero degrees. So what did we do for dinner? We did barbecue outside and we sit on, um, we went in the kotatsu. So we bought some meat from the grocery store and some local veggies from the farmer's market. And had a little barbecue beside our glamping tent that night. When we woke up, everything was white. Oh, it's snowing right now. The snow was actually quite a rare occurrence. So while I was mostly staying warm inside, the kids were playing outside. On the downside, we weren't able to go strawberry picking as planned. You have your hands. Look, I made this thing. What is it? Oh, it's just a snowball. Can I hit it at you? No, 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 no. Not with the camera in my hands. So what are we going to do right now? Uh, we're going to go to the museum. What kind of museum? It's a um, sweet potato museum. And yeah, we're gonna see lots of stuff. And what are you doing with those booklets in the classroom? I'm finding the hints for the quiz. We have this thing and if we... Um, and then if we score perfect, we get something. Why is Shin hitting all those bums and playing music with them? Because if you eat yakimo, you fart. And I heard that the yakimo farts don't smell, so they think that's cool. <laughs> so do you think that's a real research laboratory? Yes. So, do you know where the Satsumaimo came from? Ibaraki. Right, but before Ibaraki. America. The Americas, yeah. It was introduced to the Satsuma area 300 years ago, and that's why it's called Satsumaimo. And even though it has a single name, there are many varieties. What do the factory workers have to do to get clean? Wash their hands, and then get blown by air. <laughs> So this is the freezer area where they store all the satsumaimo. How cold is it? Minus 30 degrees. <laughs> and what were you guys doing with those towels? It was wet towels and if we spin it around, it'll be like ice.
I would like to pause this video for a tiny bit and point out that I think the coolest part of the tour was seeing the factory. However, it's something that's secret, so I wasn't able to film and show all of you. But it's really high tech, and you can see a tiny image of it on this floor map guide. And what's more impressive is that it's in an old school. Okay, back to your regular programming. What are you guys wearing all this stuff for? We're making dried satsunaimo. Which in Japanese is called hoshiimo. And what's the first step? Wash your hands. And then? Eat. Eat? No, you don't eat them, did you? Mm. No, you're peeling them with a knife. Uh -huh. And is it hard peeling it with a knife? Kind of. So what are you doing right now? I'm slicing the satsumaimo. Was it hard to do? Yes. Really? Why? Because, like, sometimes it breaks. Oh. I think, like, don't, aren't you supposed to cut off, like, the ends so it's easier to push through? Yes. Did you forget to do that then? Kind of. Uh oh. But I think Shoko did it right. Me too. We had to lay the slices down on the rack so that they could dry. We then got a chance to eat some dried satsumaimo. Why are you drawing on envelopes? I don't get it. Well, for fun. I think it's because they're going to use the envelopes to mail the dried satsumaimo to you because it takes around two weeks to dry. <laughs> so where are you now? I'm on top of the roof. And what are you doing there? I'm drawing my satsumaimo. You're drawing your satsumaimo? I said I'm... <laughs> what are you doing? I didn't say I'm drawing. What did you say? I'm, I said I'm drawing. You're drawing it, not drawing it. Yes, I... Okay, I see. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye. What's a farmer's village like where you're from? It's like a farm.